So it's my great pleasure to uh, introduce the winner of the 2018 James Craig Watson Medal, which was, has been presented since uh, 1887 to recognize contributions in uh, astronomy. So this year's medal is awarded to Evina Fleur van Dieschuk of Leiden University and the Max Planck, in Max Planck Institute for Extraterrestrial Physics. So in the last 25 years, the study of chemical reactions in the cosmos has gone from a small subfield to being absolutely central in many areas of modern astronomy. And Van Dieschuk has been front and center in leading this revolution. So the uh, medal is awarded for her many important contributions to the field of molecular astrophysics and astrochemistry, bringing together theoretical chemistry, laboratory studies, and astronomical observations with many instruments. Evina van Dieschuk has advanced our knowledge of interstellar processes and of the physical conditions in star-forming regions and protoplanetary proto disks. Dear Professor Harrison, thank you very much for these kind words. Dear other awardees here on the front of the rows, congratulations to you as well. I am extremely grateful to the National Academy and to the James Craig Watson Trust for this enormous honor, not just to myself, but especially to the many talented PhD students and postdocs that I have had the pleasure to work with. A special salute also to the instrument builders with whom we would not have had these increasingly powerful telescopes to zoom in on the birthplaces of new stars, planets, and even the building blocks of those comets and asteroids that Watson studied more than a century ago. Astronomy is a wonderful topic to interest young people in sciences. To help use astronomy for capacity building, I've debated the personal part of my Watson Award to the IAU, which has as one of its main goals also development. Through astronomy, we can remind people that we are all world citizens living on a small, fragile planet under the same beautiful, starry sky. Thank you again for this honor.